Well, this is the start of a story. The story of Kenneth Carmine and his associated company known as Hidden Valley. After months, Kenneth has returned to his old friend Addison, and from there, they will make their way. Let's take down a trip down the road, see what I got in there. Alright. I was thinking about doing a little hunting here soon, too. Ooh, wouldn't mind doing that. You got a hunting cart? Uh, nope. Might need to be a tracker or something for that. I'm not sure. Because, you know, you just kind of get the material when you hunt. That is very true. Um, but you can get, like, hide carts to deliver your hides and they sell for more. Okay. Gee, hey. share the- share the road. Yeah, what are you doing? You sh- what are you doing? Share the road, you shoved you me into the dunes! You were shoving me into the <laughs> freaking dirt over there. Jesus Christ, I'm just over here minding my own business. God damn, beat my ass. You one of them? Yeah! Hey! <laughs> <laughs> I used to come here all the time and slaughter these people's cows. It's, it's good money. You ever get caught doing that? Hell no. I've never been caught doing nothing. My record's clean. And caught shit. And they won't. That's the goal. Let's see how long I can go. Dude's getting chased by a pig. Was that a hog? <laughs> yeah, I think he's chased. The hog was chasing someone. I thought I was seeing that too. All right. Just making sure I'm not going crazy. Watch out for the hostile hogs and roads. Check out some of these markets. Do it up. Let me check out the bank. Hold on there, mister. Oh, hello. Oh, pardon me. Oh, yeah. We still in business. Looks like they got some, like, bandages and stuff. I bought one just in case. You just pulling some out? I was seeing what I had, and I got a decent amount of little crafting things. Not like, nothing too oh, crazy. I don't think enough like to really do anything with. Yeah. Okay. Oh, what the hell? You're going down! Oh, you best. You're a dead man! You're finished! Shit! Help me, this guy's going crazy! Someone we'll call a doctor. Sir, I, you're a lifesaver. I just want to say thank you, sir. And as mysterious as yes, he came, he was gone. Oh, shoot. Okay. There we are. Can you all hear the soothing sound of my voice now? Yes. Yeah, yes, sir. Are, are you the gentleman that saved my ass? Yeah, I actually am. Everything was a very much a big blur there. I don't know what the fuck oh. that... I got my ass beat. Where the fuck were you? You were just... I was waiting for you. You, you said you would come back here. You I was like, by a local. It was fucking. Oh, I, I thought was, I heard someone yelling out there, but I didn't think it was you. I went out there and I went to the gun shop thinking you were there and I started 
Oh, Bra- no. Browsing the inventory. And then oh, next thing you shoot. know, my face is being shoved into the wall, and that guy gave me the old one, two. Sorry. <laughs> one, two, nothing I could do. God Are you man. all right? I mean, <laughs> this guy fucking saved me. He saved my ass. He came in there. He gave him the fucking stare down, and that guy didn't want none of it, and he walked away, and he took the goddamn doctor. Can't even oh. see her. Oh, that is beautiful. That's just what I needed. My bad. Hey. Hello. You said you were taking a nap How here, so I just thought I'd wait right here for you. Oh, I came back I, and you were here, so. I thought you would wake up here oh, yeah. is why. You know? Well, I did. And I looked around and I didn't see you. So. Oh, I, didn't, I saw your I voice. Never saw you. I said I heard your voice, but I didn't see you. Yeah, yeah fuck I don't know. I was right here. Oh, you were right here? I, literally here. I don't even know. I didn't even like, do anything. I didn't even do anything to the guy. I didn't even see him. You didn't look at him funny? I didn't look at him funny. I literally, yeah. I walked out of this bank, woke up in the bank, and I walked directly into that store, and I started yeah, perusing. Hmm. Johnny? Well, you're kind of huffing a little. You need anything? I have health tonic, you know. It's got me ripe as rain for now, but I thought, oh, jeez. Okay. Hey, well, maybe some food. Let me eat some. Yeah, I got some for you. If you don't got enough. I have a lot of water. I need to get rid of some water. So I can fucking overweight shit. Sorry there. Oh, you're all good. Uh. Did you uh, drink that tonic I gave you, brother? I did. It's keeping me held over for now. I appreciate that. Oh, just gotta you wait for it to. Drowsy. Yeah. You know, it's just like I could fight a hundred men right now, but not for long. You know. Hoping I just need to get some food in me or something. Just fuck. How long y'all been in the county for? Shit, we took a little vacation recently, but yeah, that's the thing. We was we was riding around for shit, quite a while. Months. Yeah. Well, uh, that's pretty nice. How long are you riding around here? Uh, about like a month or so now. Pretty well known by now, though. Yeah, my name's Johnny Bohannon. Johnny Bohannon. Johnny Bohagen, it is a pleasure to meet you. My name's uh, Kenneth you, Carmine. So, uh, where are y'all from? Ah, uh, oh, man, just up north of here. Uh, we did originally, we were riding out of Valentine for quite some time, but decided uh, we liked it out here a little more. Yep, yeah, got a Valentine's property. Um, uh, quite the place. We have a property just north of here um, that I own. But I normally go to St. Denis for all my needs, so I'm not usually in roads or anything. So y'all some wealthy folks, huh? A little. I did ranching for a really long time, and it kind of made me quite a bit. It's kind of floating me for now. Floating you right into an early retirement. Yep. <laughs> Nothing wrong with that, though. But yeah, we just recently uh, came back from a little vacation. We're kind of cruising around. Seeing all these what's markets going are new to me, all. though. So we've been kind of riding around, checking out all the markets and everything. Think about yeah, setting up something myself. Pretty nice now. Me and uh, my two brothers are actually about to be opening up a gun shop in Emerald Ranch. Oh, nice. So that's close to my place, so might have to stop by. Yeah, well, might get you two customers right here. For sure. Personally, I do a little blacksmithing. Yeah, that's what I do. I'm a blacksmith myself. Hell yeah, it's a good trade. Well, here, to, uh, it's a new friend. Oh. You, you don't have to do that. Oh, geez, Louise, Papa Cheese. <laughs> I appreciate but, that, Yeah, Lester. I greatly appreciate that. Thank you. Yep. So where are y'all heading after this? Well, that's the big question, ain't it? Thinking about heading How's over to St. Denis, see if there's How's anything happening there. Partner? How you doing there, no. mister? Uh, this looks like a well-traveled you, uh, man. Put that string in me to use. That string. Yeah, I'm going to. I, uh... Got some other stuff I'm about to actually try out first. Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure that's him in the armored wagon right there. I wouldn't be surprised. Yeah, he loves that armored wagon. Yeah, nice ass wagon. It'll definitely save you from some bullets. Oh, there's my crazy brother. It's time to get the party started. Oh, you want a party? We can party. But I don't think we're talking about the same party. That's some good shit. Well, Jack, listen, stop wiping that nose, you crazy bastard, and you go talk your business outside. <laughs> Damn, Coke. Yeah, I gotta test my own supply now. 
So some of my brothers, they could be a little drama. I could be a little drama myself. You know what happens. You know it's life. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and uh, well, Walker thinks that Walker thinks that Rhodes is just supposed to be the uh, most uptight area where no bad things happen. And well, he thinks that he can own us and try to take us out of our uh, out of our town. You could say. I'll say. I mean, uh, that's all. Rebelling. That's all dependency upon the law. Howdy, partner. Hello. Well, you gentlemen uh, got some real snazzy suits on. Hello. Howdy. What are y'all, uh, what are y'all Interesting. Doing? Hmm. Very interesting. Hmm. Now, now, who by it, you be? I hope y'all. Hello. Nice We're asking gentlemen. questions here. Are y'all bank oh. inspectors? Oh, yeah. Bank we're, inspectors. We're inspectors of sorts. Indeed. Hmm. Well, well, inspectors so of establishments. Inspecting? You seem tired. So you I got my. From? I got my ass beat. You, s- you seem winded. So uh, I'm not really running anymore. They caught me. He <laughs> got beat up by a local. Just by a local. I don't know. He just was having a bad day or something. I was perusing a selection in the, the here gun store, and he just kind of smashed my face off the counter and just started beating my ass repeatedly. Now, why a, would someone put their hands on you like that? I think this... uh, he had some kind of gripe, and he was uh, projecting that gripe upon myself. See, I I didn't even make eye contact with this here fella. He just no. he, he blindsided me. I had no idea it was coming. Now, look me in the eyes. I want you to tell me right now. Was this fella named Slick Bakariah Baxter and uh, Jimothy Wannington? No, he was just some stranger. I'm a stranger, you say. So, uh, what are y'all inspecting in here? What's going on? Where's your badges? We're looking for someone. We're above the Where's law. Where's your badges? Nope. We're you can't badges. be above the law. I am above I the law. I need to see your badges. Are I y'all the badge. badge? I own the badge. If you don't have a badge, we don't badge. need to talk to you. I'm I think Detective these are the Jimothy. ones the ones that watch the watchman. You know what I'm saying? My name is Detective John. This is Jimmy. Together I'm Jimmy. with Jimmy and John. John. Nice to meet you. Oh, we're here to find something out. Something important. We're looking for two missing people. Two mischievous missing pips by the name of Slickariah Baxter and Jimothy. I have no idea who the fuck those people are. Hmm. Never heard of them names uh, in my life. I don't answer to anybody without a badge, so if y'all don't mind. I do mind. Interesting. Hey, interesting, folk, uh, interesting. Where'd that lady of yours go? We could, I we mean, could I'm pretty sure the law would like to hear about this. <laughs> yeah, not, so, I think know. she went to go check What's out the old name? weapon you know? Yeah, well, hmm. we can just... I'm not hmm. talking to you. I don't hmm. even talk. We don't have to answer any I have a gold hmm. doublon for you if you tell me right now. I have What'd two doublons. Something about the suits. I'm fucking rich. I don't need your I almost poor feel inclined. Money. Poor people money. <laughs> look people are poor. Just in rags. Look how you dress. Look how you dress. We'll be Look seeing how you. you dress, partner. Oh, you'll be seeing me. He stinks of lies and deceit. Of lies and deceit. Mm. You're you're detecting something. Hmm. 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 Interesting hmm. shoes. Interesting shoes. Very interesting. I was gonna ask the same question. Now, where was you on the night of 1899, September 6th, at 9:45 p.m.? Uh. I was mm. fucking drunk. Mm. We're drunk. Was you drunk with two pips? Okay, I've had enough of your shit. Now you both leave this town now. Now you smell like shit. Pick that shotgun up. We ain't here to hurt nobody. We inspect. Yeah, well, hey, you're insulting the wrong people. Insulting. Hmm. hmm. Put the, put the gun away, Jack. We don't have to answer to these fucking morons. If they want to talk to mm. us, they can talk to us somewhere else. Mm. Mm. Listen, listen, I'm not going to have you mm. over here detecting my brother when my brother's done nothing wrong. I'm detecting something. I'm detecting a few things. Write that down. Is there law in the town right now? Duly noted. There's always something in this damn county with them people. <laughs> always something going on. Yeah. Oh, sorry, sorry. Oh, you're good. Mm-hmm. Excuse me, lady. Right I'll there. move We're right out of the way. What kind of problems? Math problems, science problems, social studies, science. What is it? Geography. Geography. Geometry. You guys are from the towns, aren't you? Up in the cities. 
<laughs> we don't like city folk Clever. here. Clever fella. Clever. These fucking Spectre fellas, I'm gonna tell you, they're fucking hilarious. You got everything you need? Yeah, I was just checking out the gun shops and stuff. I mean, they have a good stock here, but yeah. Hmm. I'm all set here. But... Well, right. If I would show you my face, I would have to kill you. No, I don't want to do I that. would like to uh, roll okay. up onto the bar so I can get maybe a, a, a meal in me? I don't know. Enough is enough. Enough? Enough. We'll report this to the higher ups. Oh yeah, report it to your higher ups and your we'll stupid let the ass wagon. Maybe, maybe. Oh really? I can't look at that wagon right there. That's my fucking wagon. Eighteen hundred, buddy. Gotta have four dad, you stupid fuck. Hey, come here, partner. Now you need my goddamn wagon. Around. Why in the hell are y'all? We ain't looking at anything now. I got what I needed to come for. Write that down. Right, you now. keep saying write that down, I'm gonna put the 12 gauge bullet in your fucking Who the fuck head. do you think you people are? Shotguns They're from the cities! Shotguns, shotguns don't use bullets. Give me one second, cells. I got some for you. How about 200 dynamite, you sack of shit? I'm Jim, he's John. I'm John, he's Jim. What in the hell? I was all this aggressivity. It's all this aggression. All this hostility. If you got nothing to hide, then there's no need. We ain't here for you, son. I told you who we're here I for. I mean, we're looking for two vile pimps. I told you. I don't fucking know anyone by them names. And what's the names I said? I don't even fucking remember. My God, this one here. The capacity of a peanut. I'm done here. Let's go. <laughs> yeah, so I don't know. These two fellas just came in here just claiming to be like bank inspectors and they just started asking a bunch of questions. Claiming they're looking for some pimps. Mm hmm. I mean, that's why we had to stop on the train a few times yesterday because I guess they were prostitutes on the road, on the railroad. Oh. Yeah, sometimes. Yeah, I remember hearing about that. Um, I believe the the law threw them off the bridge. I mean, that's just that's just what I saw, Aaron, you know. So I don't know how you want to take that. It's just what I saw. Aaron. But you know, that's just I guess this is what you do with prostitutes when they're just so rampant that they're just flooding the railroads. You know, this is public access. Government pay for this. Can't be clogging up no railroad. I suppose so. But yeah, them gentlemen, and then uh, this other gentleman started getting a little mad about his uh, his questioning. I kind of heard oh. some of it, but you said you needed to go to the saloon. Yeah, that's where I need to go. Well, there's a lot more in store where that came from. We have more adventures, more shit to be doing. That was just one quick trip to Rhodes, but we'll see where this adventure goes on the next one. Catch y'all then.